All right, we are also going to start this video off with a question that is typed so you don't have to read my bad handwriting. The voltage difference between points one and two is greater in circuit A, greater in circuit B, or the same in both circuits. And if we look at the circuits, we see that both of them consist of two batteries of voltage V in series connected to a resistor with point one defined up here at the top of the top battery, point two defined at the negative terminal of the lower battery. The only difference between the two videos is where I have defined ground. Sorry, between the two circuits is where I've defined ground. In this circuit, ground is defined at point two. In circuit B, ground is defined at the point between the two batteries. And I am asking about the voltage difference between points one and two. Again, is that voltage difference greater in circuit A, greater in circuit B, or the same in both circuits. Pause the video here, think about your answer, and then come back for the explanation. So the correct answer is C, the voltage difference is the same in both circuits. So if you are not familiar with what the ground symbol means, you might have gotten this wrong. Some students who just haven't seen that symbol at all before don't really understand this question, or they see that, oh, the ground symbol is lower here, so that means the voltage here is going to be higher, therefore the voltage difference is greater in circuit A. But remember that voltage is measured between two points, and in the earlier video explaining that ground symbol, we had this sea level analogy, where if I have a mountain where I'm measuring elevations, so I say the top of the mountain is at an elevation of 10,000 feet, and the bottom of the ocean is at an elevation of, say, negative 2,000 feet then the difference between those two points in elevation is 12,000 feet. And sea level is my zero reference here. So it's implied when I say, oh, an elevation of 10,000 feet, I mean relative to sea level. So say if my sea level rises or, or sinks, if I move my zero level up and down, that doesn't change this. The difference between the top of the mountain and the bottom of the ocean is still 12,000 feet. And it's the same idea in this circuit. The difference between these two points is always going to be 2V because I have those two batteries in series and I'm measuring the voltage across them. It doesn't matter where I define zero. So here, I'm defining that point as zero volts, which means this point is going to be V and this point is going to be 2V referenced to ground. Here, I've defined this point as zero volts, which means this point is going to be positive V, and this point is going to be negative V when measured relative to ground, but the difference between points one and two is still two V. So if you don't get this one, you might want to go back and watch a couple earlier videos in this series. There's one about how voltage is measured between two points, and then there's another video defining what exactly this ground symbol means. They might help you grasp this a little better. In our next video, we are going to go over one more common misconception before we move on to some new topics.